welcome to Adi's kitchen today I'm going to prepare an excellent accompaniment for dosa that is coriander chutney so let's see the ingredients what we require for this main ingredient coriander leaves you can use also the stems but the stems should be very thin so this is approximately one and a half bunches of uh, coriander leaves three garlic I have chopped it one medium sized onions on I have sliced it a lot of curry leaves one lemon sized quantity of uh, tamarind oil around two tablespoons half a tablespoon of uh, cumin seeds around four to five uh, whole red chilies half a tablespoon of rad dal salt to taste jaggery this is optional if you want a little bit of sweetness next to the sourness you can use jaggery but also very little if you don't like uh, the sweetness in this pickle at all so you can avoid this but this jaggery really enhances the flavor and taste of this uh, chutney so better to use so let's get started place a pan keep the flame on medium just pouring around two tablespoons of oil now the oil is hot enough just throw in cumin seeds saute this added garlic to this it really just nice aromas now here goes red chilies saute this for just like 10 to 20 seconds Here goes for a dal, sort of this. This is pretty quick uh, chutney preparation. It won't take a lot of time. I am also now adding these curry leaves. I recommend you to use the freshly available curry leaves, not the not the frozen ones or not these dry ones. Once this oradal slightly turns to brown color, we will also add the onions. Look at the wood that is already started turning into brown color. I am going to add onions now. And also half a tablespoon of salt. Salt you can adjust at any point of time. Since this is chutney. It is possible that you can adjust salt according to your taste. Just saute this. This does not need to be brown. So you don't need to caramelize these onions. Once these onions are soft enough, then we can also add coriander leaves. Now these onions are soft enough. If you want more spicy, you can also add one or two red chilies or even green chilies you can also add now since these onions are already soft I am adding coriander leaves saute this it won't take lot of time now these greeny coriander leaves just get uh, mashed up 
given no time at the same time I am also adding tamarind and also little amount of jaggery remember most of the cases wherever this tamarind goes especially in chutneys jaggery will definitely follow cook for another 2 or 3 minutes and then you can transfer to a blender and you can nicely make a paste out of it and that's when your coriander pickle will be or chutney will be ready look at this coriander is almost disappeared so that's when you can turn off let it just rest and get it a bit cold then blend it look at this nice and beautiful green colored uh, coriander uh, chutney this is a very fantastic uh, and quick preparation so anytime you make dosas if you want a different uh, chutney you can also try this this is very tasty very yummy try this recipe at your home please subscribe my channel